Hey folks, welcome back to another video. Okay, so you've seen my previous video about using SideQuest from your phone wirelessly. However, you're still not satisfied and you want to be able to do it all within your headset. Well, have no fear, Wackman is here. Today, I'm going to show you an awesome way how to install SideQuest inside your Quest. So you never need to go outside of it. So if you enjoyed the video and find it helpful, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Talking about awesome, remember my Eid special giveaway is still on, where I will be giving away either Hyper Dash, Gone or Cosmo Dread. And the winner gets to choose which the game they want. To enter, all you have to do is like the video, subscribe to the channel, put on bell notifications and comment hashtag Eid2021 down below. The giveaway will end on Eid which is not far off now, so make sure you're in it to win it. Well, let's get straight into the video. So the first thing I want to mention, again, I'm sorry iPhone users, this isn't for you. You need an Android phone for the initial part, so if you can borrow one for a bit, then great, otherwise I'm sorry. You also need to have developer mode enabled to be able to do this, on both your phone and Quest. I've linked a video in the description that should help you if you haven't already got that. Okay, so this is really simple. On your phone, go onto the Play Store and download the SideQuest beta app. I'll put a link in the description as well. Then also download the Bug Eager app if you haven't already got that. Now, connect your phone to your Oculus Quest using a cable. I've linked an all-in-one adapter in the description if you don't have a phone with a USB-C port, as you can use the charging cable that came with the Quest. Once you have connected the phone to the headset, make sure you press allow in the headset. If nothing pops up, restart both your phone and your headset and try once again. Once you have pressed allow, then open up the Bug Yeager app. Another pop-up may appear to allow debugging, if you haven't previously accepted that. If so, press allow. Next, on your phone, make sure you're on the Packages tab in the Bug Yeager app. A lot of people are on the wrong tab so it doesn't work for them. Then press the plus icon at the top and press select from installed apps. Find the SideQuest app that you installed and install it to your Quest. When it's done installing, that's it, you can disconnect the cable as you won't need it again. Once you've done that, go on to your Quest and click on Applications. Then the drop down on the right to go to Unknown Sources and click on SideQuest. And there you go, all the SideQuest games under your fingertips. Now there is one final step that you need to do to be able to actually install the games. And that is to connect your headset's IP address to SideQuest. To do that, simply click on the Wi-Fi logo on your Quest, then click on the Wi-Fi network you are connected to. Then scroll down and click Advanced. Then scroll down to where it says IP address. It usually starts with 192.168. Once you've got your IP address for your headset, then go into the SideQuest app through unknown sources and click the little Wi-Fi icon on the left and then at the bottom where it says connect to wireless, input your headset's IP address. For example, mine could be 192.168.11.12 and then press connect. Make sure you put your own IP address. Once you're connected, that's it. To install a game, just find one you like and click install to headset and the game will be in unknown sources. You know this video deserves a like and a subscribe. Well, that's all folks. I hope you enjoyed the video and found it helpful. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. Well, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Stay safe and see you next time.